Welcome Leos. I'm back y'all with another video. So let's get into it. Okay, so this is a general read. It may or may not resonate as well, guys. The energies could be vice versa. Okay, so let's see what we get for my Leos. Let me get this light on because I know it's kind of hard to see my setup needs a little upgrade. Okay, let's see. Leo. Give me a message for Leo, please. Ooh, 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 ooh. What? <laughs> okay, so someone that you're dating, um, someone that you're dating, there's a lot of talk about this person. There's a lot of talk about this person, somebody that you're dating. Oh, okay. It's a lot of talk about this person. Now, this is going to be a side note. What I'm going to say could be for some. I'm pretty sure it's not for all. But I'm not sure if this person is on camera. They have some type of sex tape. Or what? But we got camera and passion. Yeah. Now this, somebody could be saying that they have your person on camera or somebody's sending videos or something back and forth between. But it's some talk about, could be about somebody that you're dating. Because we got date and talking. Y'all jumping out of height. They're coming out by the twos. Okay. I feel like you you really like this person. You feel like this person is your soulmate. This person may be calling you, expressing how they feel to you because we got love call. We also got soulmates. Um they're saying that they're over something in their past. They've moved on from their past. They want they want to come towards you and be with you. Um, I feel like when this person found out, when you found out about this, some of y'all know already. Some of y'all may be getting ready to get this information. You found out that you got some competition. Okay, you might feel like you got to look over your shoulder all the time. Or there's, there's another person in the picture that you're trying to get information on. But somebody here wearing a mask. Your person, the person that you're dealing with could be wearing a mask. I feel like this could be someone that you just newly started dating. Because we got coffee cup. And ascending. So it's kind of like y'all linked and then it's starting to go. It's like it's like y'all linked up. It started out small, like y'all was just meeting up, conversing, being friends, and then the relationship is starting to ascend. Okay, the relationship is starting to um, go to the next level. It's going into a new phase. Yeah, I see this. I see, okay, we got palm tree and twin flames. Okay, so this palm tree is like the marriage card. This person could have been married um, to their twin flame or you want to get married to this person. But we got sabotage. We got a hammer here. So it, it looks like maybe something that they built or that they were working on, or something that you built, or that you were working on, it got sabotaged. Something ended, like it completely ended, and it ended bad. We got coughing, and we got the Grim Reaper. So somebody could be um, getting a divorce. I'm seeing that as well. They're divorcing someone, they feel like it's their twin flame. Um, 
yeah, I'm getting like this person trying to make better choices and they're trying to heal from that. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of talk about this person that you're dating, how this person could have uh, separated from their past person, left them in some type of heartbreak, um, saying that they just, oh no, that they was just, uh, that they love the paradise of it. They love the benefits. They like the benefits. They could have been in a situation because they like the benefits. And then they broke up with the person and separated from them. Yeah, the person that they could have been dealing with could have been an empath. They took advantage of this person. They used this person. Um, yeah, they did a lot to this person right here that they could have been dealing with in the past that they could have possibly you know, either live with this person, they could have lived with this person, or they could have been married and they got a divorce or they're in the process of getting a divorce. I'm seeing somebody saw a picture or a video I'm seeing that for some reason I'm getting like maybe you saw a picture or a video or there's talks uh swirling around about your person, but I'm getting like somebody having sex on camera. I'm getting also like you and this person could live together. Maybe this is what you guys could be into. I'm seeing that as well. That's just another scenario. I'm getting like living together. Or meshing finances together. Doing things together. Um... We got a Grim Reaper here. We got a love call. I like you. That's a lot. I feel like... Someone cut off communication. Someone hasn't spoken to someone in a while. Someone cut off communication. Somebody hasn't been engaging since this has happened. Maybe you haven't spoken to this person or you and this person aren't on speaking terms right now. Yeah, I'm getting not today. And then we got love, addiction, photograph. Somebody loves, somebody got some type of sex addiction or they love to take pictures or um, like the record having sex. This person is running. I'm getting like somebody's running from um, from the real commitment, which would be like a marriage or an engagement because we got the runner and engagement ring. So this person wanted to do all this other stuff, but they're running from uh, the real commitment, which could be an engagement or going and getting married. They like you a lot. We got Cupid's arrow and kisses. 
So they like you a lot. Like, there's a lot of affection here. There's a lot of giving and receiving. It's like a reciprocated energy here. And they are falling in love with you. So I'm getting falling in love with you. So this could be why they are kind of like running from it. Because they could be afraid that they are falling in love with you. But it's something about, it's some rumor. You're going to find out something about this person i don't know if you've already found this out or this could be coming to the surface but it's something about this person this person is snake it's something about this person they got snake energy this could be the reason why they're why their marriage could have ended because for some of you it looks like this person you could find out like this person could be married or just got out or this person is trying to get out of a marriage we got separation abundance wedding rings and phoenix so it looks like if, if this is your story and the person was married it looks like they're trying to get out of this uh this marriage or they already have but the reason that they separated, it could have been in regards to dealing with some type of money. They could have, it could have involved money. And this person is adapting, like they're trying to adapt. They're trying to adapt to this. This is new energy for them. But I do want to see why is camera and passion here. Why is camera and passion here? The Phoenix. Okay, so this is a closing of a chapter. And then we got a uh, coffin and paradise. So it's like not. Um, let's see. Tell me more. Why is the Phoenix here with camera and passion? Mirror and wedding rings. See. Maybe they used to do this with someone that they used to deal with all the time. Um, but now they're separated. I want to want to know more about this. Feel like you find out about this when you and this person move in together i feel like some of y'all y'all relationship has expanded and maybe there's talks about moving in together or you and your person already have moved together and you just find out this truth Somebody, we got not today and seduction. I'm sitting telling you, there's a lot of talk about this situation, this person that you're with. It's a lot of talk going on. It's a lot of rumors going on because we got, there's talking about how somebody could have been how this person uh, separated from their last, how their last breakup was. Um, and then it's like, it's just rumors spiraling around because we got talking and a butterfly. There's rumors spiraling around that your person could be married or this person is in a karmic relationship. Like they could feel like you and their situation is a karmic relationship. They feel like this person is going to stab you in the back because this person is a jack of all trades. This person like to take risks. They strategic. They got a bunch of options. They might not be showing their hands and they're gambling. Okay. And somebody could feel like, oh, no. We got hammer and axe. People could be like, yeah, this, mm -mm. this person ain't it. This person is wearing a mask. They're pretending to be your soulmate. And they feel like when, when the time comes that this could end. 
Okay, and that's what I'm getting. I want to find out about this person. It's just something about this person. It's like, mm, I'm getting sneaky, real sneaky vibes. Real sneaky vibes. Like, this person got something to hide. What is this person's intentions towards Leo? The person that they are saving. Show me their energy. Reveal their energy. This person is look does look like they're putting their effort to move forward. But they don't think that you know or that you should know about something, okay? It's too much information, okay, and that they that they don't want you to know about their past, okay? So they're trying to uh, shield you from something from about their past. Could be involving the Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You got the tower, could be done with the Scorpio. Judgment, the sun, the fool, and the two of pentacles. Yeah. This person could be juggling you and a, you and a water sign. We got the Queen of Cups, the Sun, and the Queen of Wands. Um, tell me more about this Queen of Cups. The Hermit could be a Virgo. be um avoiding or um withholding information in regards to a water sign they're uncertain about this connection and i feel like they may be on a break from this person i feel like kind of like they're avoiding this person right now We got the Nine of Swords. They know if you find this out, you're going to be mad. Okay, so they're going to wait. They're waiting to uh, talk to you about this. Because they're undecided about what to do with that connection. I see them realizing that they should have waited. Yeah, the six of wands. Okay. <clears throat> They're feeling like they should have waited. Because now, <laughs> oh 
Okay. Okay, so your this person has had a plan. Everybody's telling them congratulations. Oh, what a good job. What a good job, you and this person. Like, yeah, good for you, good for you. But there's something that they're not telling. Ten of Swords and a Page of Pentacles. Okay, somebody's still hurt about something. I mean, he's seeing a Libra could be involved. See, your person could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. They're kind of just like trying to get over something that they're still hurt. They're still hurt about something. Okay. Um, they hide it. They hide it. I'm definitely seeing somebody could most definitely like be a married man. But I feel like they didn't they don't want to tell you this. They won't don't want to tell you some type of truth because they think they, they was gonna get cheated on. They thought that you would maybe go out and cheat on them. See, this person looks like a coward to me because it looks like we got the Nine of Swords, Four of Wands, and Emperor. This person um, was complaining, upset. They may have been coming to you, talk of, telling you about what's going on at, um, with their situation. And they just decided to just walk away from the situation. They didn't even try to fix it. They just walked away. Could have came to you, but they, they didn't resolve the issue. They just moved to a different situation. See, now they could be in a relationship with you because we got the Ten of Cups and the Strength card, but they're still carrying this burden. Ten of Wands. Yeah, see, their relationship with this water sign could have been a water sign. Could have water in their chart. But their relationship, spirit came in and, and yeah, this had to be done. The tower and the ten cups. Their relationship fell apart. It could have been for financial reasons. Five of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles. So it looks like this person wanted someone who um, they could collab more with, could be like with finances, who's more on like, I feel like this person could be a little toxic. They got a lot of little toxic little ways, but they wanted to invest or they want to be invested in, okay? Yeah, it looks like this person, they got a lot of worries. And I'll tell you, I keep getting married, man. King Cups and Hierophant. There's somebody could still be married, okay? Um, Somebody forcing somebody to say something. Like, this, this thing, the, the rabbit hole goes deep, okay? But it looks like they're regretting some type of decision, Um. They could have known that this person was going to make them say that they were in a relationship. Um, they know that this couldn't be worked on, so they left. Okay, so it seems like to me, like, they left a relationship or a marriage or someone that they were dealing with uh, because it looks like a financial reason. They could have seen you over here with this team of 
um, and they want it to be invested in. Why are the two of pentacles here? There's a lot of competition. There's a lot of arguments and disagreements because this person, uh, they're too back and forth. <laughs> they're back and forth. They don't know how to sit down. Um, they're too uncertain. Like one minute they all for it, the next minute they not. Um, I see you feeling like you need to give this person some time because it looks like this person is starting arguments so they can go out with their friends or go out and hang out. Like they're starting to do things to where it's like it's evident that they have other things going on like or that they're, they're, they're just trying to get some space. I see you spying on this person. I see you spying on this person because you, you want to see what this person is, is talking about. Is If it's true, like the things that they're saying, if it's true or not. And I see you also evaluating whether or not if you want to keep, if you want to stick around. You see what the people are saying about about this person. You don't know if it's true or not. But you hear, I feel like <laughs> this person knows that they're being talked about. Yep. High priestess. This person knows that they're be, that they're being talked about. They feel like they should have waited to make a decision. Um, they know that they're being looked at in a bad light now. Like They know that they're being looked at in a bad light. Whether it's true or not. They're starting to feel overwhelmed too. Because they know that they're being talked about. But they made a bad choice. This is something that they did. Okay. They thought it made them look like a man. They thought it made them look more macho. -y. So they're going. They they thought it was gonna enhance their their image, but it really it really fucked it up. Really, <laughs> it really fucked it up. Now we got the half. No, not the half. The four of wands and the temperance. So I keep getting. A marriage that's for some but they was gonna wait to tell you they wasn't gonna tell you right away and they kind of regret me because they got caught in a lie they got caught in some type of lie they feel like they was like a relationship was being forced on them so they thought the best thing for them to do is to end it and leave okay so it looks like this could have been what the rumors are coming from Someone that they could have been dealing with previously. You heard about it, but you, you're not really sure about how true it is. 
There could be like some type of sex tape. Somebody has somebody on camera doing sexual acts or something like that. They thought that it was cool at the time because they thought that it was, you know, it made them look like more interesting, more, oh yeah, I'm the man. I'm the, yeah, I got this down. <laughs> Whatever. Mm. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.